What is up you beautiful people? Welcome to another cocktail vlog. My name is Johnny and this is Simple Drinks. I've just returned from a phenomenal vacation in Greece. It was awesome, but it's even better to be here with you. And we are going to make another delicious recipe. While I was in Greece, I tried a lot of their national drinks like uh, Ouzo, Metaxa, Cipro and stuff like that. But Ouzo kind of stuck with me. So I, when I came back, I did a little research and uh, I found an interesting cocktail recipe. It's called Ouzo Tini. It contains Ouzo vodka, pineapple and uh, lime juice. And it sounds interesting. I haven't made this before, so this is my first time and we're going to try it together. If you don't know what Ouzo is, it's a dry anise flavored aperitif that is widely consumed in Greece. It's made of rectified spirits that have undergone a process of distillation and flavoring. And it's kind of mostly similar to other anise drinks like Sambuca and stuff like that. So now that everything is ready, let's make an Ouzo Tini. First of all, we need a chilled martini glass. We have one here sitting chilling like a villain and we are going to start off with of course ouzo 30 mils one ounce followed by vodka 30 mils one ounce followed by pineapple juice 30 mils one ounce and last but not least, lime juice, 10 mils, one third of an ounce. Now we need ice. And we're going to shake the cocktail for about 10 to 12 seconds. Beautiful. Now we're going to discard the ice from our glass. And strain the cocktail or double strain it better in our chilled martini glass. You don't want small pieces of ice in your drink. Garnish with a lime wheel. And that's it. Ladies and gents, we made a Luzatini. Cheers. Oh, wow. This is nice. This is delicious. You can taste Uzo. Just a little bit of that citrusy flavor from lime, pineapple, I can't taste vodka, it's sweet and tart at the same time but it's really nice, it's delicious, refreshing, this is, this is a really good cocktail, mm, really good, and ladies and gents, if you ever get your hands on a bottle of Uzo, try this, try to make it, let me know in the comments below think as always you know where the playlist will be if you want to see more recipes right over here thank you very much for your support and i'll see you in the next video bye bye